Caravan Salon 2021 and this is the 2022 range from Florium Fleurette from France. I'm going to take you around the vehicles here and this starting off with this one Baxter 60 LG 6 meter vehicle weighing 2,834 kilos and it costs uh, just under 63,000 euros. So 6 meters L shaped lounge and a side bed at the back with a washroom through here as the toilet and there is the shower in the corner this sort of thing might suit for example somebody uh, could be somebody traveling alone or maybe a couple i think um, because of the lack of storage in the back because there's no place for bikes it could be the sort of thing that some people who are a little bit easier living uh, could find attractive. Here we have a uh, wardrobe, a big fat fridge from Thetford and a freezer and a compartment above it where if somebody really insisted they could put a television. Talking of really insisting on doing things I suppose you could really put an oven or something up here if you wanted to. People ask me, where's the oven? The oven is in the shops and you can buy one if you want. So uh, here we have the, uh, the cooker. Now two hobs is the thing for 2022. In fact, you wouldn't be seen on the campsite with three hobs. So the idea here though, being that the hobs are further apart, space further apart, and the sink has also got bigger for many uh, vehicles. Now, the uh, decor here, sort of raw, the French. It's, um, uh, this color is very Mediterranean, in my opinion. And there's plenty of seating there for a number of people. Oh yeah, one what's down here, we'll have a look. That is the water tank, the black water tank. Storage under the chairs and under the fridge. So move up the range here. Florium Discover 74LJG. Okay, this is, I think, the most expensive van on this stand at nearly 100,000 euros. And this is a style from this brand which has i've seen for the first time in 2022 it looks it's smooth but it looks as though it's sort of wrinkled and bendy now you might like it but if you don't then you need to get uh order a different style for your table plenty of space around the kitchen and it's got this matching um rippled effect there uh, double floor down here. We'll have a look at the double floor. Plenty of space down there. And possibly down there, there's the electronics with a fuse box, a charger, and other things. There, we've got uh, the heating. More storage. I'm a big believer in double floors. Of course, it puts a lot of money onto the vehicle, of course tanks down there right, German layout and in the German layout we will find under the bed a large wardrobe and on the other side a chest of drawers so first draws that what is that that's an unusual set of drawers isn't it I wonder what that could be. So, German layout comes like that. Cushion goes in here. I haven't got it at the moment, so I'll just stick that one in there. And that's your steps up to bed. Far better than using, using a ladder, in my opinion. And you can also put storage uh, use uh, in here as well if you want you can also access the bed the, uh, sorry, the, bed, the uh, uh, wardrobe under the bed like that and you, 
you can hide things there. Storage, headboards at the back, ledge up there, and uh, though it could do with a USB point for the telephone. Close this door here, and now we've got a large toilet and a shower here as well. Up front, there's a, another bed, and of course, storage all the way around, including something a little bit unusual there. And there, let's have a look at the next one. Sixty-five LJG. This is sixty-three thousand. Has a German layout and uh, is six hundred and fifty-nine centimeters in length. Chest of drawers here under the bed and the same setup as in the other van at the back. This one is a much cheaper version, but it doesn't have any, sorry, it doesn't have the facilities, not any, but some of the facilities of the first one. Here is another rather expensive integrated vehicle, Florian Winchester, and this comes at a cost of 92,000 euros. I will have to come back and see that later when the people inside uh, go somewhere else. In the meantime, we'll go and see this Magister up here, 70 LM. Got a, what's called a crystal layout. And this thing here is going to cost 68,370 and is in the 7-meter class, 697 centimeters in length. And it has a queen bed at the back. Incidentally, if you want to see any of these video, any of these vehicles in more depth, then that will be possible. And uh, okay, here we've got the Migrateur 64 LDF, and this uh, costs 63,000 nearly, and is 647 centimeters in length. Side bed, like the like the first one, fat fridge, and here toilet. Oh, and here we've got some uh, additional storage. There's your wardrobe. and some shelving. Large table. Also with the ripple effect on the table. So, uh, we'll have a look at this. Winchester, if that's the correct pronunciation of it. Or Winchester. Right, I'll have to take my shoes off. I knew I shouldn't have put some high heels on today. Right, uh, what's this, 92,000? Bed up there. Well, it's got nice lighting in here. Can't fault the lighting at all. Go back to the back. Go back to the back, I shall go with the back. Right, okay. Wardrobes near the side, storage above. Head, headboard looks rather flash. Um, show you the, the washroom. Toilet. Now these vehicles, all of these vehicles are available from Arisa Mobile Hartman. 
the address for which will be uh, under this video. And with the, or the website address anyway, I'll give you address. Two uh, burners. Oh, I like this. Round table. This one doesn't have a ripple effect. If you don't like the ripple effect, never one of these effects. Uh, all in the Fiat. I don't think I mentioned that, but they are. This one's got an uh, automatic gearbox. You have a manual. If you bought it new, if you got a second hand, you get what you get. What you're getting. Uh, big fat fridge. Oh, central locking here. See that? That comes out like that. And if you want to lock it, you turn this thing here around. And it still comes out. I'll have to take that bit out. Take the whole thing out. Got central locking here, which you activate by turning that around. And down here, a place for your drinks. So you can uh, uh, get the get these vehicles from Rise Mobile Hartman, uh, amongst other places. And uh, I'll ch just show you around as well, because the same company actually has the Itineo uh, motorhome, which is here, which is one of the uh, Rapidos. Now you can see some of them. This is, uh, was started off as a pretty cheap motorhome, but not any longer. 70,000, well, 70,000 euros for an integrated. Maybe that isn't com comparatively uh, expensive. It's an air was meant to be, though, a cheap brand. There you go, 219 centimeters width, 661 centimeters uh, long, 280 high. That's very similar to what mine is. Well, oh, mine's a bit longer. There you go. That's a look around the Ateneo stand. If you want to know more, then you'll have to see the separate video on Ateneo. But quite a lot. Hey, have a look at you as well. Look at you've got uh, these other wild, wild stamp here. Yeah, there. Volkswagen down there. You got Ford to the left, Iveco, Ducato. Uh, Mercedes, the hold down there, Frank, yeah, Pilot, Le Voyageur, HRZ, very interesting, 4x4, Notin, Rapido, Carter go down there. Isn't it great? I mean, this is for anybody into motorhomes. This is the place to come to in the first week of September. So, we'll go back here to the uh, Floret, Floret, sorry, Florian Floret stand. And uh, as you can see, it's made in France. And uh, I think very nice looking van. So, thanks very much for watching. And I hope you found that of interest. And uh, if you're interested, you might want to subscribe. All the best from Dusseldorf.